There's new witness testimony today in the Lori Vallow Daybell trial. Prosecutors presenting new evidence to the jury, including a key phone call between Lori and her husband, Chad Daybell. Daniel Woodruff is live in Boise, Idaho, where he's been all week long with the very latest from the courtroom. Daniel. That phone call between Chad and Lori Daybell zeroing in on the search for and eventual discovery of Lori's two children. Their remains found on Chad Daybell's property. Also today, new testimony about the investigation into the suspicious death of Chad Daybell's longtime wife. Are you okay? So they're searching the property. This is the phone call jurors heard in court from June 9th, 2020, between Lori and Chad Daybell. Not long after this call, investigators found the remains of J.J. Vallow and Tylee Ryan on Chad Daybell's property. Both he and Lori are accused of killing them. Also today, Fremont County, Idaho Sheriff's Lieutenant Joe Powell testified about the investigation into the death of Tammy Daybell, Chad's longtime wife. Because of... Um all the suspicious circumstances. Jurors saw photos of Tammy's body being exhumed in Utah and just before her autopsy. Prosecutors say she died by asphyxiation at the hands of another person. The defense, though, pushed back. Are you aware of where Lori Vallow was when Tammy Daybell died on uh, October 19th? No. Okay. Would it surprise you to know that she was in Hawaii? No. Inside the courtroom all week, Kay and Larry Woodcock, grandparents to J.J. Vallow, Lori's son. It's going very smoothly. Outside the courthouse today, Larry spoke to reporters. This is a not about me. It's about those children and the four, you know, the four people that were murdered. And after that witness testimony today, the judge here ended up sending everybody home early at the request of prosecutors. One of the prosecutors had a death in the family. Trial will resume here at the Ada County Courthouse tomorrow morning. Live in Boise, Idaho, Daniel Woodruff, KUTV 2 News.